using the sap green and maybe a little bit of the ultramarine. I want a real, those are pretty thin transparency paints. I want it, I just use lightly. Very lightly. Let those little, see those holes and all that? Let that happen right now. That's what you want. Just real light across the paint. I have it on this edge, a little bit of a bead there. You don't have to fill them in right so thick. Just let them happen. Let the paint catch, stick, and pull. Real light. Don't push. And then the way you want, just pull the way you want the fronds to go. And then if you do a real light, you'll get those breaks. So it does look a little bit like the edges are sharp. Okay, now I'm going to switch over to my bigger knife and go for those at the top. Real light. Probably got a little bit too much on there. On this edge, tilt your knife, start where you want, real light, let the paint touch, and then pull it. For the dark shadow, see that'll, that'll give you, and we'll highlight that, and we'll make it look more like palms with pointy ends here in a minute. You're just going to fill this in, but let these things happen. Just if you're not getting this, it's because you're, you're going in too deep and trying to make things happen. Whereas if you just Just go in real light. And if you, if you can't do it with this big knife, go to that medium size. Try it with that. Of course the back of it's a little bit thicker and bigger. Start to thin it out on the edges. Well, let's try to figure out the way some of these are. And one coming in here. He's real brave now, going right across here. Let it happen. Don't push. Real light, let it grab. Most of this is going to end up being dark. I 
Uh, let me see here. I think I got it messed up there. Just try to think about how the fronds come out from the tree. And then, like I said, there's not much wind tonight, so we don't have to worry about how it's going to be bending in the wind so much. Just using sap green with just a tab of ultramarine in it, make it even just that much darker. See how that, that happens when you, and then the second time you go over, you kind of roll and with the tip of it. But we'll do that mostly with the lighter paint. 